Right. Right, I'm just gonna quickly do this for a sec. So as we actually don't have to worry about it looping back into the opening movie, but hello and welcome to well Digimon World 2003. Although I did have to put the title down as both the European version and how the rest of the world saw it, which is Digimon World 3. Oh, I could have actually sort of like gone back to the beginning and started with the original Digimon World, but found it to be rather short, so, although I'm not sure if I actually did the whole of the game, but, yeah. So, what I'm going to do is exit out, and we are going to start a new game. Yeah, you can also actually tell that this is the European version because it got massive borders. Alright. Kusanagi City, street corner. New York, 3 a.m. <laughs> mm -hmm. They're late. What are Teddy and Liv Ivy doing? <laughs> we won't have time to play Digimon Online. And, actually, this is the point, because in this version, Digimon is an online, is a virtual online experience. Didn't want Ivy to come, but Teddy and his big mouth told her. They should have gotten a, a login pass ahead of time. And... Junior taps his feet like Sonic the Hedgehog. Walks around and... This just in. International Police SAP have located the European headquarters of the crime group AOA. Together with the army, they raided the, their headquarters at midnight last night and have arrested the leaders, leaders of the AOA inside the compound. Officials believe these arrests will connect recent international terrorism to the AOA. AOA. That's the group that did bad things to Digimon. With Digimon. <laughs> I can't believe anyone would make Digimon do any do bad things. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Alright, Teddy. Thanks for waiting, Junior. Sorry we're late. And Ivy. Junior, why are you talking to yourself? It's creepy! <laughs> About time, Teddy! <laughs> and why is Ivy here in the first place? You always say that Digimon are for kids. <laughs> hey, I'm interested in this one online. Okay? And I never said that I hated Digimon. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. Junior, Ivy, come on, let's go to the online centre.
Right. We are at the online center. <laughs> so, this is the Megami online center. Ooh. Yeah, this is the Matrix system. It digitizes their ideas and thoughts and sends them to the net. I wonder how it works. I want to see what makes it tick. <laughs> hey, what are you two doing there? Come on, let's set up an account and log into the digital world. Welcome to the Megami Online Center. This service is for those traveling to the digital world. Is this your first time playing Digimon Online? Yep, and all three nod. Before we set up your account, you will have to choose your partner Digimon. <laughs> Never thought about that, did they? <laughs> choose one starter pack, A, B, or C. Each pack has three types of Digimon. A is the balanced pack with Kotamon, Renamon, and Patamon. B is the powerful pack with Monmon, Agumon, and Renamon. C is the manic pack with Kumamon, Gilmon, and Patamon. <laughs> <laughs> yep, and he's. Come on, Junior, what are you worried about? Just pick a pack with a Digimon you like. <laughs> but Teddy already knows what pack he is going to be choosing. Especially from that uh, thought bubble of Patamon. And number two, Gilmon. So he's wanting the Manic Pack. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> if you like all Digimon, then you don't have to worry. Come on, choose and let's go to the digital world. Junior, you still haven't made your mind up. You better make up your mind or I'm going ahead. Ah. Junior, I'm really going to leave you here. <laughs> yep. We're ready to see you and your partner that you want now. Let's do this. The account name will be your name in the digital world. Please use your partner that you want for one of the free soft packs. Right. I really want to know what happens when you actually change your name. Because originally when I played, I just used the default, which was Junior. And because Teddy uses the same his own name for his account, I said, yeah, I was lazy too. So, we're going to do this. Right. So, our starter packs, there are three packs. The Balance Pack with Kotamon. Balance Swordman also learns to, also learn to heal. Renamon gets the enemy with lightning and ice. Patamon, healing specialist, very likeable. And the thing with this is, this pack is, it's probably a good advantage to have two healers on squad. That's not what I want. Because we've got the powerful pack with Mon Mon, 
has various guns, expert marksman. Agamon, I like to spew fire, very aggressive. Plus we also have Renoron. And here, the problem is there's no healer. But the Manic Pack has Kumamon, powerful martial artist, he's pretty fast. Gilmon, mischievous Digimon, he'll learn odd moves. And anyone who has watched the first season of Digimon 1 will know that Gilmon was a artificially, was kind of artificially created. And we also have Patamon. So we have power, odd moves, and a healing expert. So. I'll actually choose the Manic Pack. And... Done. Mm. Yep, and he walks off ahead! <laughs> And now we're heading to the chamber room. Just as he steps in, the other two turn up. Hey, are you leaving without us? Though I think it is one person to a chamber pod. And we're in Oscar City Login Room. Oh, so this is the World Digimon Online. Alright, so we have to head to the main lobby. Your head is called a satellite. It manages your data. Of course, I have one too, but you can't see it. So that thing floating next to me is actually all, is actually a data manager, and well, lots of other things. Yep, let's get the. Digimon sorted out.
Wait, no, 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 you're the one that's fast. Alright, Ivy. No, my name is Kale. Don't forget it. Oh, too lazy, so I'm still Teddy. <laughs> well, here we go. There's Kumamon, Gilmon, and finally Patamon. You know what's going to greet us the moment we walk out of this, walk into the central sector, Oscar City. Bing bong! And we're straight into our first battle. Kumamon versus Coagamon. And we hit Coagamon for 74 damage. And response immediately 43. Oh, he only has 10 magic MP, so he can't do any tech moves, so we have to do regular attacks. And that's it. So we've got 4 XP and some money! And the other thing he mentions is the folder bag for card battles. You better go to the Yellow Cruiser. They'll teach you all you need to know about card battles. Oh, we also load into the Digimon Lab. Types of attacks. Use physical magical support techniques as needed. Attack attributes. Attack opponents with opposing attributes and use ally, attribu ally, ally attributes. Technique effects. Effectiveness of poison, paralysis, and others differ with Digimon. Status ailments. Status ailments, except curse by Cardmon, will go away after battle. DNA Digivolve. 
Combine two Digimon into one. After DNA Digivolve, the two will switch. EXP distribution. All Digimon that appeared in battle will receive experience. Training. Digimon can be trained at the gym using TP. Training points. Digivolution skills. Digivolve form skills will increase as you gain XP. EXP. Hmm. Right. Alright. Yeah, Kotamon can learn Agumon and Vimon types if you train machine tolerance. Monmon, once it learns ultimate, train its strength, machine and wind tolerance. Kumamon, which is one of the ones I have, train wisdom and spirit. Renamon, the spirit, strength and defense. Patamon, wisdom or strength. Agumon, Increase dark tolerance. It'll do. It'll learn dark type digivolutions. So that that means he can actually. That means if you learn dark tolerances, he will be able to digivolve into Skull Greymon. Gilmon, premise of the partial. So the key is to strengthen its weaknesses. Alright, I think that's everything, because all of this is just switching Digimon. Alright. Most goals to go to Seru City and defeat that leader. Kumon, Gilmon, and Patmon. Yeah, because we don't have any items, weapons, or armor. So what we're going to do is we are going to go into the inn. Because the inn Because this is where you rest your... Digimon, it's 8 bits per Digimon. And since Kumon did take some... ...damage in that last battle... We will do that. And here are the Gardramon. 
So if you want to save the game, you have to talk to him. Excellent Matrix Drive. Prepare to save. Yep. Create new data. And here we go, our three blank discs. Just a minute. Yeah, because it takes... Yeah, because it's four blocks. I think it's four blocks per save file. Which is the reason why you only have three discs here. Although, I don't really have to worry since I have two memory cards, so we are going to save. And this, even though it's on a computer with a hard drive, it's still going to take the same amount of time as it would on the memory card. And saved. I only have 26 bits. Wizard Mon to recharge the item shop. I'm going to buy two power charges. That at least gives us the ability to heal. Now go on, run the pawn shop. Unfortunately, this lot is way too expensive. When Gargamon run the armory. Fortunately, since we don't have any money for any of this. Get my boss. Yeah, that's all he says. Yeah, because you can't get here. And this only takes you up to the... I think it takes you up to the inn. Yeah, because you get this woman 
Clean the dust and that's enough to clean anything that's dirty. And I think this actually takes us ah underground path. Okay. Ah, and here's the yellow cruiser. Folder is a set of 40 cards to hit together. And you can put up to four of the same card in a set. <laughs> what are you making? Two sets first wins the battle. Hmm. 
me the PG cards, the program card. Light, blue, green, red, black, and brown. This really increases when you draw a card from the deck with that color. This energy is used when summoning Digimon above rookie level. These plugs is a blue PG card. Use it after an opponent's PG card, you can trash that chart card before it executes. Right. So we got all of that done. Not cool enough, so you can't come in. in there. I think I'm gonna leave that. Alright, so let's go up here and quickly save our game. Again. It's always best to save often.
Alright, and back out into Oscar City. That's where I just was. I'm gonna just only take me back into the Digimon lab. So this is all we can do here. Right, I can only do use that once I get a certain Digimon. And here we go. That should take out that to Piermon. Power charge. Right, so no one has any training points. So we can't use the gym anyway, so... Right, let's see what that did. Right, so now he has 5 TP.
I think that's also something that a certain another Digimon can only use. Kunamon. That should be a nice chunk of XP. Six XP. It's time. Hmm. It's a Piermon. Oh, sixty one damage. Ouch. Bubble. Let's see what that does. And he's down. <laughs> but it. Yeah, so Patamon's the only one who gets XP because he's the only one who's still in one piece. Right, let's head straight back into Oscar City and straight to the gym. Well, yeah, it's the inn, so we should have some extra funds.
and saved. We have 48 bits left. Away we go. I've got to remember this is since both Fuelmon and Patamon have more MP, you can actually use text. So we got the Pyrosphere. And he's down for 180. Remember, with those, with those holes, we do need a certain Digimon and a certain Digi Egg. Attack should take him out. And Kunamon is down. Should get 6 XP from that. Yeah, because with these. I do believe you prob think you probably need Armadillamon for both this and one of the others, plus the respective Digi Eggs. And could be wrong, has been a while since I've actually played this. Although I did go a lot further, though, that. was using a few unfair methods. Alright, so I've got Padamon in the lead. Two. 
Look, you've got this pontoon here and those holes. Because this, because that harks back to. Second season of Digimon. Alright, we've got ninety eight bits. I'm gonna do one more battle with Patamon before I swap back to Kumamon. Here we go. And it's another Kunemon. Oh! Cheap shot, only 43 damage. Sorry to burst your bubble. I'm gonna knock you for six. Kumamon. Once I'm done with this, I'm going to quickly do some training. Right. Right, so Bear Fist takes 40 MP. So we can only do two attacks.
Right. Oh, it's a Piermon. Train with Digimon. I'm gonna leave that. No, oh, it says Spirit or Strength. I'm gonna use one TP. Increase by three. Uh, sex, so train his weaknesses. Since his weaknesses appear to be, I think that spirit, knowledge, and defense. So defense is lower. Defense up by five. And fails. Spirit up by five. Alright, so what I want to do is go back to the lab in Oscar City and remember what specs I what I have to do for training Kumamon. Because with Patamon, it says this one Kotamon Pokemon and Vmon types with train machine tolerance Monmon once it learns ultimate train its strength machine and wind tolerant Kumamon wisdom and spirit right This is more strength. Yeah, perhaps it's a partial, so street key strength key is the strength of its weaknesses. Right. 
So at least I know I'm getting all of this right. Uh, uh wisdom and spirit. Right, so let's head back to Leomon's gym. And get Kumon on the treadmill. Alright, so it's Wisdom and Spirit. And as you can actually see from the spec, they are extremely low. With Spirit at 23 and Wisdom at 27. <coughs> so let's expend one TP on... <coughs> spirit Training. So, spirit up by three. Study. Getting it right. Can he do it for the fourth time? Yes, sir. Yes, he can. Where's the by five? What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to level up Patamon's strength a bit. Go for the third time. Oh, no. Spirit only up by six. Right, Patamon still has three. So I'm going to do some spirit and strength training. That time, plus two, and power up by four. Right, so what I'm gonna do is same thing here.
We're gonna try and get his spirit and wisdom up to the same point. That's two. That's three. Okay, so... Considering how bad and bruised our Digimon are at the moment... Go back to the inn and save. Well, rest and save. There we go. So we're into the wild forest. Yep, there we go. Buckler! So, got some equipment. Yep, there we go. Mm. 
So we got some equi some equipment on one Digimon. Well, Kunamon. That's just Pyro Spirit. Oh, we have an inn. And the Gardramon is up here. So nothing much down there. Mm. 
Ooh, Kuagamon! Yeah, and the cost keeps burning up. Okay, the Kugumon. XP, Batman! I don't think that's the way I'm supposed to be headed. And there goes one Mint Imperial! Mm. 
Oh, finished wizard. Uh, well, doing all right though. This is just. Oh. And uh, I have just. Let's manage to get started. Although I'm still I'm still an hour and a half into the stream and I have barely scratched the surface. And Patamon's up to level four. <laughs> Well, at least until it starts to get going. Although, like with every single role-playing game, you can't really dodge the old uh, random encounters. Oh yeah, I did actually play this many, many moons ago. But a lot of time and a lot of uh, and a lot of nights deep sleep has uh, eroded those memories. So. This is partially a run from blind. Although it doesn't really matter because I still have the original disc and the manual. So at least I'm good on that. Alright. <laughs> ah, and we're at Seiru City. Alright, well, first thing I need to do is find the inn. Nope, that isn't it. Oh, yep, yeah. pretty much the same. Although, because with Twitch, you have to, I had to actually list it as Digimon World 3, which is technically what it was actually rebranded that we re renamed as, well, renamed from. All right, so. <sighs> oh. 
Right, so he does the same function as the guy in the Digimon lab. Alright, Zephyr Tower. Um. Ah! There's the Gatamon! Yeah. <laughs> I like it. It's 8 bits each digital one in Asuka City server. Asuka City's in. It's 12 in the Forest Inn and it's 16 here in Seiyu. Hmm. Huh. Okay, there's nothing there, but we do have. A Divermon up here. Oh, so he'll only open boosters, but since we don't have any boosters, buy one card, open booster, edit folder. Don't really need to do any of that at the moment. Right. So let's have a look at the armory. Oh. Right. So the sword isn't any really good for anyone. The cat glove is good for Kumon, but it's 500 bits. The spear is good for Patamon. Everyone can use that short sword. I can get uh, cat ears, sun visor, and tin helmet. <laughs> uh. Uh. Just one minute. Oh, let's say it's a good good thing about having the manual on hand. Uh. Battle status screen. Ah. Right. Uh. So it's eight. Through 13, 14 through 20. Just one minute. Let's just bring up the status screen. Or at least of one. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, it's not really self-explained. So, as I say, from here. All the stats from top from top to bottom left are strength, defense, spirit, wisdom, speed, and charisma. And the right side are they're actually the tolerances. So it's fire, water, ice. Wind, Thunder, Machine, and Dark. Though the gate, the gate, the TP at the bottom is the training points which you use to train at the gym. So, at least it is actually explained, but I think there might be say because I think there might be a few guys that do have most of the info from the manual in them right 
to remember which button does the uh, to close the status. Alright. And now it's off to Gardramon for a little save. So it's always best to save often. Company. Don't tell, but we're here to spy. <laughs> yep, so they even have a few spies in their mists. So, you leader is training at the protocol ruins, it's northwest of here. Oh, that's good to know. Uh, actually, I do because before I actually started out I did actually get a few power charge but that's practically all I have although I think the wizard one here might have some yeah Zephyr Tower. Right. Yeah. Because I already have three. The. Actually. Right. Heal all elements, 70 bits. Antidote disc for poison. Life disc is 500 bits. <laughs> Muck plug. Temporary speed up. Strength up, defense down. Heals health and magic in my heart, but it's 2,400 bits. Hmm. Yeah, it, as I say, it's why I actually picked up a few power charges when I actually went into the. when I was at. At, back at Oscar City, so just in case I need to heal anyone while I was uh, out. Uh. Yeah, probably the cheapest item in the uh, whole restaurant, but I think we have to go and find. Alright. I think this is one area I haven't explored. The Gale Tower. Oh, there Dramon's asleep.
Right. So I think we have to head back. We have to head back to the East Wharf. We have to head back through Dive Mons Lake, then back into the. Eastwire Forest, then into the Protocol Forest. Batting a thousand here. So I think I might have to swap in Gilmon to get some extra levels on him. Sort. Oops. <laughs> get it right, you moron. So that So that was a path to nowhere. Or did I head in the wrong direction? For the protocol ruin. Yeah. Oh, and Gilmon's been poisoned. Not good. I get 21 XP and 40 bits out of that. I think I probably have to head back. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'll need to head back to Seriu City to uh, reacquire my bearings and figure out where I actually have to head to. Go to actually uh, encounter the city's leader. And I just did a boo boo and selected an attack and not tech. Uh, did 77 damage. Oh, and he managed to evade. Oh, so they are in the Protocol Forest. So, so you were actually saying that I was actually headed the correct way going through the Protocol, going into the Protocol Forest. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, so I just have to, uh, feel my way around that blind maze in the protocol forest. Bullymon. Yeah. Oh, and we managed to one hit him. I think I'm going to do another swap so that I can get a equal distribution of XP between all three Digimon. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Go. And we're into the protocol ruins. That didn't do much. Oh, as I said, doesn't really matter, but because I've actually, because I've, I've actually gotten a good way in, but so I know most of the plot, the plot line of what happens although I don't think I ever managed to get off Oscar's server before because well because the last time I actually played this it wasn't exactly with all right since Kumon took a little bit of a pounding there I'm going to use one of my power charges and probably what I might do is the old swap -a -roo routine Yeah, I saw that guy and I thought, nope, right, so let's 
tagging Patamon. Tough little beggars, these guys. Alright, another boom bubble. It's an ambush. Good, he didn't take too much damage, so I'm going to trade in for Gilmon. So hopefully, if his Pyrosphere can do a bit more damage. Alright, so let's see what Boom Bubble does. Only 90 damage. Too late, I already already went for the bear fist. Sixty-six. Now I've got to do is pray for a block. <laughs> no. Well, <laughs> oh, yeah, at least I know where I'm headed now. Yeah. <laughs> So at least I didn't. At least I didn't lose much in the way of experience, because I f think I'd only managed to get Gilmon up to level four. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's see. I just need to double check on the 
Yep, free power charges. Right, because I have a buckler, but it's... I do believe I equipped it on... Yeah, I equipped it on Kumamon. Oh, yeah. Because at level 1, he only has 10 MP. He doesn't even... He, at level 1, he doesn't have enough MP to do his, o his only... His only tech move. Because it's only at level 2 you can actually do anything once he actually gets 40 MP. Oh, that's what. I think that's why they call this the Manic Pack. Although I do believe. Because I actually think that might actually be because of his low spirit and wisdom. Yeah. Yeah. Because I think he. Because I think it might be because it might actually be because of Kumamon's low spirit and wisdom that he has such low magic points. <laughs> right. So I think what I might do sort of like as a goal. Though I might actually hang around the protocol forest and I think we think we'll go down to the protocol just go out to the protocol forest and take on as many enemies as we possible we can and try to get everyone up to level five you don't have to worry too much about Having to expend any of my uh, power charges since we will have the inn nearby. Right, uh, Crabmon. Let's just go all out and boom bubble it. Oh, and 171 for a knockout. Although, what I might actually do as well is head 
back to the training gym. It's just outside of Oscar City, and... Up the stats on this on this lot. <sighs> yeah. I think what I'll do is I'll just head back to Leomon and his training gym and oh, so it shouldn't take too long. So I just have to go through to what go through here and Nope, wrong way. <laughs> Beat him on. Let's see what the regular attacks do. 48 damage. Right, let's boom bubble it. Hell <laughs> oh, yeah. So I'll, pro I'll probably be done by. I'll probably be finished because I. Normally I only ever go on for about two hours or so. Although I will be back with this next week. Yeah, but it'll be around 11 o'clock UK time, so either BST, GMT, it'll still be 11 o'clock, so, well, on, on the Wednesday. Right. Right, let's spend 5 TP. And see what that gets a little patamon. That's one, two, three. Can we go for the fourth? Spirit is up by 31. Let's see if we can do the same for sh for for strength. And that's an eight. A seven. Another seven. And ten. Four. Thirty-two. Right, and for Gilmon, he only has 60... Oh, that's because he's only level 3. Well, I've already expended most of the 5 TP he got for going up to level 2. But I know for Gilmon, you have to... train his weaknesses. <laughs> yep. So, let's start with the lowest, which is defense. That's 
one, two, three, and can he do the four? Yes, he can, for a total of defense increase of eight. And let's try doing the spirit. Actually, I'm gonna do use five TP for spirit. That's seven, eight, and only up by fifteen. So, Kumamon. Uh, let's do a 5 TP on Spirit. And once I get him up to the next level, I'll do Wisdom. And... Spirit up by 32! Alright, so let's go back into the... Wire Forest. And... Crack some skulls! Let's see what regular attack suit. Ouch! 114! And he blocks it! Ragamon. Right, let's stop at the inn.
Oh yes, Digivolve learned Angemon. All right, so what I'm going to do is swap out Patamon for Gilmon. Oh! Oh, gee, that's me with a one hit kill! See if RNG will bless me with another one hit kill. And nope. He didn't get poisoned. An ambush.
Right, I think what I'm going to do is head back to the forest in. I think I'll have to get up to 200 XP for Gilmon's next level. Alright, so over here, down here, and into the inn. Saved. Alright. Let's see if this little trick works. Now, nope. the old RPG auto reset doesn't really work, so. Since we saved, I'm going to close content and exit out of that. And that is going to be it for tonight. So, let me just... Yep, as per usual. Hold down the button, it thinks you want steam when you don't. Yeah. So. Uh, well, the schedule is going to be, well, going to be off for the next two days. Well, Thursday, Friday, I'm going to be off. Because Friday was normally my Friday chill stream. But since I don't really get much traffic on those... I actually did manage to get a bit of traffic here. So, yep. <sighs> At least that actually worked. <laughs> well, worked to my advantage. Yeah, so, schedule is Saturday and Sunday will be Soul Worker, as per usual. Saturday will be Haru Estia. Sunday will be Lily Blumachan. So hopefully, with the equipment I have now, I should be able to tackle Duplus Horizon. Although there is a lot of, there is actually a lot of new, there is actually a bit of new content that has been added, though that is specifically based around Chiarowell, and I won't be dealing with her again for another week. So, right, let's uh, rustle up Discord and see whom is on the go. And I think. Yep, yeah, Jive's already gone because, well, Fabulous Lomax is hosting me. Uh. 
uh, I think the only person that is going to be around is... Hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, praise be the Grand Herald, Door Supremacy. Hmm. So we're going to have to uh, switch over to the... At least that double R actually helps. Yep, click. Yeah, as I say, because I know Drive was actually done because, well, yeah, Fabulous Lomax is now hosting me, and I know he's not going to be on at least until Friday because he's. He's a little bit busy with work. So got that host locked in so as I said next scheduled stream is for Saturday at 11 p.m. and I'll be back with this next week on Wednesday at 11 p.m. so this is the Blighty Otaku signing off until next time I'll catch you later